Residents in Abaco's Gully and Gaza shantytowns now have less than 28 days to evacuate before the Shantytown Action Task Force moves to demolish those illegal communities. Since the task force visited the island last week, a number of structures have already been torn down. Here is Minister of Works and Family Island Affairs, the Honorable Clay Sweeting, on those efforts. On Friday, uh, I think 10 homes were uh, were demolished, 10 structures, uh, not homes, that were built since um, we did our first assessment. Also, we removed uh, generators that were powering uh, both locations, which is an environmental health hazard, as well as dangerous in regards to um, electricity, um, uh, the, how the math is, how it was wired and connected to the other homes. So four um, generators were removed on the first day and I think five the second day. But um, they provide their 28-day notice. We did all our groundwork um, so that in 28 days we will, we will ensure that if no proof of ownership is provided, that the homes will be demolished. Getting reaffirmed the government's commitment to eradicate illegal communities countrywide. The government is real strong on this issue. Um, you know, Bahamas is for Bahamians. Um, everybody's entitled to a home, but everybody's entitled to do it in the right way. So we're very strong in our, our stance on this. I told the persons in Abaco when we had the town meeting Thursday night that we ain't come to play. So we're very serious and we're sending a strong message to persons throughout this country. Hi there, I'm Corval Pfeiffer. Thank you for watching our YouTube page. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for all things Set and S.